oh my gosh i know it's been so long i'm sorry i've been having serious internet problems like sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't i have at least three videos that i haven't even uploaded yet because my internet connection sucks so i have a couple tutorials and i also have what was it I can't remember what else I did. It was like a month ago that I recorded these videos. But anyway, as you can see, I straightened my hair and it is a big poofy mess right now. <laughs> because it is so nasty outside. I wish I could show you guys. It is dark and gloomy. It's raining sideways. Horrible. This happens to me every time I straighten my hair. It's like I'm just doomed. But anyway, I did use a heat protectant, and I also used the Sabino Moisture Rock, which was my heat protectant. And I also used a little bit of the um, Paul Mitchell Skinny Serum. But as you can see, it did not work. My hair was nice and flat before I left for work today, and now this is the end of the day, and it is a big, poofy, frizzy mess. Um, but yeah, I did a trim, and here's a little link check. Where's my little brush mark? It's about an inch past there. I think I cut like half an inch off. So it's like just below shoulder, or full shoulder length, whatever you want to call it. <sighs> but yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do with my hair tonight because I was planning on keeping it straight for at least two weeks. But, um, I don't know. I might just have to do a bun or something. Because I definitely did not do all that straightening just to wash it out two days later. Mm -mm. That's too much work. But, um, anyway, there was another point to this video other than to say hello and show you my do. Or my don't, rather. <laughs> I got my stuff. Well, I ordered stuff from Quimet's for her spring sale and I finally got it today two weeks later exactly um so yeah I haven't even opened the box yet I'm gonna share that with you guys I actually forgot what I ordered I know I ordered the um the omelet and olive heavy cream but other than that I forgot what I ordered I know they were like sample sizes because that was the only thing that I've tried so far so I ordered sample sizes or the smaller sizes of the other two items and I can't wait to use them although I will have to wait since my hair is still in its straight state I don't want it to get all curly yet so yeah I ordered the honeybush tea soft gel mmm let's see distilled water extracts of organic honeybush Organic lemongrass, organic redbush, vegetable glycerin, something else. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's really like a gel. It doesn't smell like anything, but it did spill all over my hand, which is gross. Yuck. It's a really thin consistency. I don't really know what I would use this for. My hair is kind of thick. Yeah, I don't know what I'll use this for. Maybe on a twist or something. I don't know. It's a little too thin to be a gel for me. It's kind of like watery. And I ordered the Olive and Honey Hydrating Balm. Which is pure grapeseed oil, pure olive oil, vegetable glycerin, emulsifier, wildflower honey, and something else. Some kind of scent. Oof. You see that? Hydrating balm. Hmm. I don't smell anything with this either. Maybe I'm stuffed up. I definitely don't smell anything. This is a little thicker, as you can see. This is more of a gel than the soft gel. It's odd. They just have totally opposite names. Yeah, hmm. This is probably good for twist too. It looks like it has a good hold, a soft hold. And of course, I got my beloved. Mmm, I can't wait to smell it. Mmm, -hmm. yummy. 
yummy yummy okay y'all that was all I wanted to share um I don't know when I'm gonna make another video I don't know when I'm gonna upload the videos that I have because like I said my internet sucks but you can follow me on Twitter and visit my blog um glamswagger.com also you can find me on Twitter under the same name glamswagger so yeah